Are you coming? Just trying to make sense of all this. Hey, was that you really flying? Yeah. I, I ain't never seen nobody fly like that. Pretty good. Thanks. Well, I just wanted to thank you guys for I catch my bus to Pittsburgh. What? Bus to Pittsburgh? What are you talking about? See, rumor is the grid back up in Pittsburgh. And thanks to you guys, I got enough art to catch my bus tomorrow. Somebody snatched a bag out of them thugs' hands and arc went everywhere. Well, what, what about a bus? How does it work? Some Einstein converted to run off of cooking oil. Now they're taking people back and forth for 10 percent. Is there any way you can get us on the bus? I sure can. <gasps> for about 20 percent. Is this for 20 percent? Mm, please. Yeah, this could work. Sometimes I wonder what life would be like if the outbreak never happened. I'd be a junior in high school. I'd probably have my driver's license. I'd be thinking about college. And I would have all the latest video games. But is all that even important? What kind of person would I be? Would I be the man Dad wanted me to be? Someone he's proud of? I try so hard to do the right thing. Maybe all of this has nothing to do with it. Maybe life would just be different if Dad was here with me. Maybe I'd... Maybe I'd just be me. All right, let's get these guys going. All right. Hey, uh, get comfy, grab a nap. Uh, I guess leaving around midnight, so uh, seriously, get comfy. It's a long trip. for what happened back there. I should have thought of a better plan. But I thought you hated your uncle. I hate living with him, but 
I don't hate him. He used to babysit me when my parents would travel, so... I sort of spent more time with him than I did with my real dad. He was a different person then. Look, I'm really sorry, Kitch. I'm sorry about the watch and your hideout and everything else. Look, you don't have to apologize. I wouldn't even made it this far without you. I'd still be in my hideout, you know, planning instead of doing. Besides, I ended up having to get rid of my dad's watch anyway. Either way, I'm really sorry. Don't worry about it. Thanks. So I heard we we're passing by the Sky Medics facility. I thought it burned down, but I don't know if it's true. Someone sent out a running test on babies in there. Why would you do that? I don't know. It's sick. Gonna go make it all the way. It's gonna be a long walk. Man, you need to do something to fix it. We can try. We gotta hurry up and go. Okay. I accidentally set off his EMP blast practicing the Morse code. Of course. It's only got 21%. If it fires another blast, it's done. It'll drain its hard power completely. Hey! Sorry about the bus over there. Before y'all get out of here, I gotta give you this back. I can't keep this. Look, you kids be safe. Thank you so much. All right? You too. What is he doing? Looks like he's hiding. From what? I think it's a stick. What are you doing? He's going the wrong way. The office is this way. You sure? Yeah. Don't you think we should follow him? Yeah, he's probably just taking a shortcut or something. Let's just go the way I know. He'll follow.
Is this it? Yeah. We've been here before, but not since the outbreak. Are you ready for this? Hi everyone, this is Chad, the director. I really liked episode eight. I wanna thank you guys for all that you're contributing. Our characters are coming alive and taking on very strong personalities thanks to you. Keep the input coming, please. We asked you guys for suggestions on the transportation for Kitch and Maya. There were a lot of great ideas submitted. In the end, we settled on a biofuel powered school bus and we're really happy with the way it turned out. Also, Elizabeth Roper submitted a poem that inspired the song Maya sings on the bus. And Kitch's voiceover was pulled from the content in the community journal entries. We love the creativity you guys are bringing. Please keep it coming. We continue to develop each episode all the way up until the very last moment. Oftentimes we're editing and or even shooting a final clip the day of the release. Just two more episodes to go. Keep the input coming. We love hearing from you guys. We'll see you next week.